Forget the guilt when it comes to enjoying chocolate. It has heart healthy benefits, which means break open a box or unwrap a sweet piece. And you know what? You can feel good about it. Well, all of that is going to be so much fun because we're here in the kitchen right now. And we're showing some love for chocolate with Lucas Schubert, FAME program coordinator. And that actually stands for Food as Medicine Every Day right here from St. Luke. So yeah. what do you guys do in that class? Yeah, so FAME, or Food as Medicine uh -huh. Every Day, it's a cooking and nutrition education class that we offer for the community. Um, and so just really learning the health benefits of, of a lot of different things, um, learning just the basics of nutrition, just trying to get back to eating better. And, and this is a great way to do that with some heart healthy fruit and some heart healthy chocolate. Exactly, you're showing us chocolate covered strawberries. Yeah. Who doesn't love that so we can eat guilt free? Right. Um, about that. Why is it important to choose the right type of chocolate? Right, so uh, chocolate is very uh, beneficial for us. Good uh -huh. for, source of antioxidants, really good for uh, relaxing and calming. Um, but if we don't choose the right kind of chocolate, it can have too much sugar, sometimes a lot of milk, or just things that offset the health benefits of chocolate. Itself. Okay, so you've done the hard work mixing yep. in like 60 and 100% chocolate. Yeah, so, so we are melting our chocolate here to start with a coating for our chocolate or covered strawberries. What I like to do is do about 66% because you still get a little sweetness, but then add in 100% and that really mixes up and gets you that bitter, kind of dark chocolate flavor that you expect. Okay, um, Lucas, let's get going with let's this. Let's go ahead and get started. Okay, so we have some strawberries here. The key of our strawberries is to make sure that you've washed them and dried them because we don't want them wet or the chocolate won't stick so much. So we've melted our chocolate in a double boiler too. This is a good way to keep it from burning. You can put it just in a pot and then melt it in your bowl. And then what we want to do is we actually, a little, a little way to make this a lot easier on you mm -hmm. is to take a, a toothpick. You can go ahead okay. and join me here with that and actually stick it in the top just very, not too far, and you have a good handle, so you can like, really handle it a lot better whenever you're dipping it. So you're gonna dip it into the chocolate, give it a little twirl, and then pull it out, and it'll, it'll start to drip off. You just wanna get the excess off, and you can go on the edge, pull it off, and then you have your chocolate-covered strawberries. See, when it's all set up like this, you make it look so yeah, easy. Yeah, right, so go ahead. Dip and in, you try. Twirl a little bit. Twirl a little bit. And then with the, the chocolate that's dipping off, so mm -hmm. hold it down a little bit more because you want to try to get all the excess off. Okay. And then give it a little dip on the side. Could you okay. Now turn it upside down. Perfect. All right. Okay. And then we have our coatings. So there are a lot of different ways, coatings that you can do, but these are good, again, nutritious, heart healthy and coatings. Uh, p chopped pistachios, some walnuts, mm -hmm. some flaxseed, and some coconut. So real good, um, nutritious coatings. So okay. the, the key to coating your, your strawberry is to actually tap the side of it rather than dip it in, if that makes sense. So you can get, cover your coating or your, your strawberry uh, fully. Okay, so you're going than, with the walnuts So there. I went with the walnuts. So just dip it in and you don't have to be, you can really be creative with it and, and really enjoy it. And you can do multiple at the same time. You're doing great there. You got it all covered in there. All right, and that's it. So then a tip with this is to have some styrofoam or some foam board, and you can actually just set it in, and you're ready to go, and you can put it in, and it'll set up, rather than setting it on the side, which sometimes you get maybe a flat edge. This will make it nice and covered all around. And they look just they like look they came pretty. from the store. They yeah, awesome. and so we have some here, too. Um, fully done and you can do yeah the white white chocolate so, so let's actually just talk about the difference okay. between white and milk and dark chocolate perfect yeah we just have a little, a little bit, bit of time, of time. Yeah. I get that yeah so white chocolate the one thing is not going to have any of the health benefits of dark chocolate at all zero um, okay. so it's just gonna be <laughs> cocoa butter sugar and a little bit of milk so making sure that you're really using more of the uh, dark chocolate and then this could be a decoration for right. you. Okay, yeah. well Lucas, thank you so much. Well, thank you. Now you've made a lot of chocolate lovers just so happy because again, everybody's looking for that around Valentine's Day. For more information, go to stlukescasey.org.